Ooh, look at her. She's pretty and she's beautiful. Wait for it. Here's number two. Getting them ready. Look at that. This is take number three. Let's get it in. another video we have eat with more love. love and entertaining ASMR and we have all this good 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 food here we have some uh, entertaining, ASMR plus. entertaining ASMR plus, plus. <laughs> um, we have all this good good food here we got some steaks some mm, mm, mm. so good I don't know mm. what what were these Dom Domicino steaks or something like oh, that right. that we got. It's the next best thing to tomahawk apparently. So mm. yeah. already so good. That's what we got. King crab, shrimp, corn, lovely sauce. We got some blue cheese butter for our steak. Love blue cheese. Herb and butter. Some lemon. Lemon. All the fixings. We didn't miss anything. <laughs> I'm gonna say grace. We're going to get it in. Mm -hmm. Heavenly Father, thank you for this food we're about to receive. Nourish our bodies, Lord. Take anything that isn't of you out of this food. Bless those who are less fortunate. In the name of Jesus. Amen. 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 Let's um, eat. Right Don't forget our stone IPA. And I've got my water bottle. Mm -hmm. I'm going to start with this steak because it's been calling my name. Right? It smells so, so good. Oh, what I want to do is take this good old yes. blue cheese mm. butter sauce. Yum. Add that to the top. What's the, what is the blue cheese butter sauce? What? It literally is it? just butter with blue cheese, just room temperature <laughs> butter. Just mix it in, a little bit of seasoning. And I, first of all, love blue cheese I with eat. any red meat. Me love too. it. Me too. Hamburgers, everything. So... It's only fair that I would make some blue cheese butter. Um, I, also, I also like doing some steak butter with a little bit of garlic and onions and garlic powder, mm. salt, pepper, just. You know, I never thought about doing that at home, make but it I know fancy. now. Yes. Oh, I, I took the most. It's fine. <laughs> I ain't use my fork yet, so. over here. Mm -hmm. Ready to dive I'm in. But wait. First of all, this steak just cuts mm. so, so easy. Tender. Ooh, look at that, look at that. Oh my gosh. I like mixing a little A1 with that blue cheese. Let mm. me try that. Let me have some A1. Mm-hmm. Mm Thank you. Oh God, that is so good. Mm-mm-mm. -hmm. I can't wait to put my lips around this mm -hmm. steak. Mm -hmm. Let me try this steak sauce. We have that butter nice and soft with that blue, uh, mixed with that blue Lots. cheese, it just melts on there just so nicely. Oh my god, that steak sauce! <laughs> so Bomb. good. <laughs> I'm oh my god, <laughs> y'all gotta come to my our house for this. I'm it, at their house. <laughs> <laughs> it cuts so Dude, nice. Made these I like sure. this nice piece of fat that's right in the middle here. Right, it's I nice love it. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. I don't know, y'all. So tender. Shrimp. This blue cheese dressing, too. Look at that. Mm. Look at that. We're talking about this food right now. Mm. So good. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Grab me a crab leg, but 
I'm, I don't know which one to grab. Right? Let's see. Mm, not this buddy right here. So what's been happening, ladies, in the news? Anything interesting that you've heard of lately? Um, there's some stuff going on. There's definitely some stuff going on. Mm -hmm. Although I will say today was kind of a slow news day. I didn't see a lot. Um, but there's some, some stuff that has been buzzing this weekend. So you guys know that Jay-Z is catching a lot of oh my goodness, flack yeah. for... Um, basically taking um, ownership in one of the um, NFL teams. And so a lot of people are basically kind of calling him. First of all, let me just pause and let you see how that lemon just drip, drip down drip. there. But um, yeah, he's getting a lot of mm. a lot of flack for, for essentially just, um, you know, initially telling people to kind of boycott the NFL because of Colin Kaepernick, um, you know, not, not being allowed to play because you know, kneeling in the silent protest, but you go and you sign on to, you know, an NFL team. And so that's a little mm -hmm. conflicting. So I, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? I have mixed feelings about it. Yeah. It's like you first, you support him and now you don't right. business deal. You don't right. People, a lot of people are saying that they want to support him. I personally, like, I understand the fact that it could look a little hypocritical yeah. of him to, you know, go about signing on the NFL. However, you don't know what he's doing. He may be making some big moves, you know? And, yeah. and so a lot of it is kind of like maybe wait and see, see what's going on. And I, and I always hope that any celebrity um, will use their celebrity for, for the good. So I'm, I'm kind of curious to see what he plans on doing. Hmm. Yeah, and hopefully it is a good, whatever it is, it's good, you know, yeah, I mean, for I guess, everybody. Yeah, he, he definitely, you know, needs to address it, you know, um, like you said, using his platform for good mm -hmm. is always good, mm -hmm. but, you know, like you said, it does look a little bit hypocritical. And people um, are saying it's a money move, it's a, it's a money move. Right. And yeah. I don't know what it is. It could be a power move, could because, be power. you know, right. sometimes when you know, the cards are on your table and you're the one calling the shots. You make decisions and those decisions could benefit people and call, it could benefit mm -hmm. Colin Kaepernick. Right. So I guess Colin Kaepernick kind of did like some sort of subtle message and I don't know if this was on his social media, but there was some sort of like subtle message basically like, yeah, the air has not been clear between us. Like we're not good. So I don't know what that means. I hope that Jay-Z addresses it. Jay-Z and Colin? Yes. Oh. Yes. He bit, he essentially gave kind of the... So he didn't direct it towards him specifically, but with all the buzz, you got to think like, hey, this this probably is directed towards Jay-Z. Mm -hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Well, whatever he's doing, let's just hope he's using it for good. Maybe yeah, it's it. his way of, you know... You know, some people... Sometimes it's like, if you want to be a part of a solution, you... You got to uh, get in there. Integrate. Right. Yeah. I'm all for integration. And because I just like like she said, I mm -hmm. hope it's for the good for mm -hmm. everybody, not just money, because they got plenty of that. Yeah, they're not hurting in the money department. Right. So, well, yes, more money is better. <laughs> you know, at the same time, you have to look at mm. that. The best. I'm dip it in that this looks sauce good. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I, I just hope that it's going to end up benefiting everybody. That's true. And that, that you use your platform to speak upon, like, these injustices and things like that. And, you know, I I hope that he definitely is um, going to address this soon, though, too. I think that's mm -hmm. important. He's been pretty yeah, quiet about right. it, so we'll see what happens. Right. But, you know, they're infamous right. for keeping stuff hush-hush. Because we are. forgot when Solange <laughs> busted you upside your head, Jay. We still want to know what happened. And then, <laughs> and, then, and then Bay released this whole CD. And we was like, <laughs> so that's true. why he got his yeah. behind popped she, in the elevator. She's she just going to sing about it. And mm -hmm. it's like, oh, okay. <laughs> I guess we'll wait for the next album. Right. <laughs> and see what happens. And see what happens. Mm -hmm. With this stuff. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's so funny. Oh, we, you got to show the people, honey. That looks Girl, dull. Right? Look Take that. a bite. Oh, look. Wow. Mm -hmm. you see mm -hmm. that. Mm-mm-mm. Mm -mm -mm. So good. I'm going to put some lemon drip on here. Mm -hmm. She makes the best sauce. 
So anybody seen the new Lion King movie? Speaking, mm, speaking yes, of Beyonce, so what's your rating on that? Because I haven't seen it yet, and I've gotten so many mixed. I was excited for it, but now I'm kind of like, I don't know how I feel. I mean, go see it for yourself. Yeah, because so, people you know. are saying well, stuff, right? What's your, different. What's me, your mm -hmm. I definitely enjoyed it, only because it brought back memories of my childhood and, you know, the excitement with the Lion King and everything like that. I mean... Everyone's different. The only thing they didn't do for me was the the circle of life scene with all the animals. Like, right, singing, which is I like wish. super. That's the one yeah. of the most That's important. Part like, it yeah, is. they're like so known for that. So. So. <laughs> the most important part. Yeah. But other than that, I thought it was really good. I liked it too. I really did. I was surprised. Mm -hmm. And my granddaughter, all every time they sing, she was up dancing. So <laughs> she liked it. <laughs> so it was good for her. Huh? Mm-hmm. And mm -hmm. she don't know nothing about Lion King. <laughs> So, and I just enjoyed the movie, yeah. She did enjoy it. I did too, so that's different. That's really different for me. Mm -hmm. well, I'm going to have to check it out and see. Because um, I am excited for um, The Little Mermaid, though. Yes! <laughs> so, of course, I don't, well, I don't know if you guys heard. So, they have casted, what's her name? Hallie Bailey. Bailey. Let me get it right. Because mm -hmm. when they said she was casted, I thought it said Halle Berry. And mm -hmm. I was confused, what? like... Okay, isn't she gonna play her mama? But no, <laughs> ha Haley Berry, which is part of the group, is it Holly Bailey, Chloe uh, and Haley? Chloe, Chloe and Haley. Haley. They're really cute. They're girls, and I believe like Beyonce is is um, basically like managing them. They are mm -hmm. awesome. We've seen oh, them okay. um, in concerts. They usually will headline for they headline for Beyonce, correct? Mm -hmm. right? Yeah, they and usually open it for her and everything. Really? Yeah, they're awesome. I haven't Amazing. seen them. You have to check it out. Like I think, I think your granddaughter would like the little song. It's cute. It's poppy. It's modern. And what well, she probably already know. It. She, <laughs> she probably does know. already know it. I'm sure she I does. Just don't. But they were very cute girls, and one of them was cast to be the Little Mermaid, which I'm super excited for because that's probably one of my favorite Disney classics. Is the Little Mermaid, and there was a lot of um, a lot of uh -oh. slack going on, or a lot of um you know, uproar going on on social media because she wasn't Caucasian like the character that's played, um, you know, oh. in the animated movie mm -hmm. of a, not of a fictional character. <laughs> um, so, oh. <laughs> oh. let's start with that. Um, but yes, I'm very excited. I haven't heard anything. And then a lot of people are talking about who's going to play Ursula, which I love Ursula. Mm -hmm. I mean, I know Ursula is like, you know, she's not a good person, <gasps> yeah, but Queen Latifah. Yeah, she I was like Ursula. Does Queen Latifah, know? I've seen Adele, which I don't know. Adele, oh, I don't know if she has an edge, but I think that could work. It could work. Mm -hmm. She has a good personality. I like Adele. I think she has a flexible personality. I think, I almost think like Ursula should have like a, a, a London Ooh, accent. Yeah. yeah. That would London accent, yeah. Um, I, I'm interested to see who gets to play mm. Prince Eric. Oh, King they Titan. they cast it. They know who's playing for sure. Oh, they do. I, yeah, I don't know who it is. I gotta, we gotta look it up. I have to look that I don't up. Remember. I did not know that. Mm. But yeah, I'm 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 super excited for the Little Mermaid. Um, so I I cannot wait to take my girls. I will be there front and center on opening day. So I I liked Aladdin too. I'm kind of loving that Disney. I haven't, is, even I haven't seen, seen Aladdin. That. Will Smith was mm -hmm. amazing in that. Oh my God. He did so good. He really took me there. So the whole good. movie was good. Mm, Ooh, all that. Ooh, that looks mm -hmm. good. <laughs> oh my god, this is like butter. Mm. Wow. Definitely check out Aladdin. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This steak is so good. It is so delicious. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Oh. So, Renee, have you ever, have you gone glamping before? No. no. Me and Danae just went glamping this past weekend. We just went glamping. We actually went to Austin. So, before I give my review, <laughs> first of all, let me just say I learned that I'm bougie. People tell me I'm bougie all the <laughs> time, sense. but I'm like, I'm not bougie. I'm very down to earth. Um, I think I'm bougie. Um, <laughs> I had fun. Let me not say that. So, I had a great time, but I'm letting you give mm. your review on your glamping. <laughs> yeah, Tell them what glam food. Yes, uh, exactly. Let's say first because so, a lot of people are like, "What the heck is mm -hmm. that?" So, mm, that's so glamping is pretty much a play on words. It's just 
glamorous camping or yeah. luxurious camping. So it's like camping, but with the convenience of having like a shower and the kitchen and a fridge and yeah, not air conditioning, pee in the woods. something like that. Right. <laughs> yeah, basically. Right. So that's what glamping is for saying, you know, you might still have access to a bed or, you know, different glamping. Um, there's different like forms of glamping depending on what you have that's convenient and available to you. Very true. So yeah. So how did you like Austin? Um, I liked it a lot. I liked the fact that we definitely like just disconnected from like everyday life mm -hmm. and you know, things like that. Um, it was definitely relaxing. I just feel like I didn't have to think about anything. Um, it was definitely hot. Very, very hot. Yeah. Um, I wasn't obviously not used to like the bugs. I saw some real daddy long legs. Oh my I mean, goodness. these were some big spiders. Gigantic. I know they don't <laughs> like do too much or do they? Do they bite? No. They're I just don't do. like them. I'm like, oh. they just they're just creepy. They're just like yes, creepy looking. That part, that part right there. So yeah, there was there were a lot of <laughs> a lot of bugs. Yeah. Some stuff was flying around. <laughs> um, yeah. Some of our friends were like, oh, they don't hurt you. I'm like, I know, but it's flying at me. Yeah. Okay. I, know. <laughs> I got a question about it. I've mm -hmm. never done it. So glamping is you have a toilet. Mm hmm. You. So I don't. So, to give you a background on our um, glamping, so I've actually looked at some glamping things. Actually, there's one in South Carolina that looks beautiful. It's like a cabin, oh, but it's yeah, like in okay. the middle of the woods, but it's luxurious cabin. Like, it was, you know, you can yeah, have that wine. Yeah, that would have to be what I do. It was, it was beautiful. So, <laughs> I kind of was like expecting that, but it, it wasn't. As luxur it wasn't as luxurious as that, not saying it was bad, it wasn't as luxurious as that, but essentially it had like a common area, it was air conditioned, it was just a big room, that had a full table, full kitchen, a bar, like a bar, tables to, to sit and eat, they had like this little porch, and so, the sleeping accommodations essentially were in these like camp, these airstream campers. Mm -hmm. that had about like six or seven of them. Six of them about yeah. six of them, and and each airstream would be like bed. Like the one we had, it was like one queen bed and two twin beds, and you know it was air conditioned. It was decent. And then they have this other area where there's showers and like toilets, so you can like get ready and stuff like that. So that's kind of the accommodations uh, that we sit in. I guess my most uncomfortable thing is the fact that we're like in the campers, and so. You do have to like kind of walk around the camper and into the woods into like this i guess you would call it an outhouse yeah it, i mean i hate to far. call it an outhouse it wasn't far but like you know you got to kind of walk through the woods to get to this like thing to the I bathroom me, take a I shower would, yeah i was just you you know, in, the, in the middle of the night there's gonna be like <laughs> something roll up on me like a coyote or <laughs> I don't know, and it's all dark around. And so then I'm you can like, hear stuff moving in the yeah, bushes. You so moving. you're like, okay, just keep your eyes focused. Get to the outhouse. <laughs> mm -hmm. I stepped on a big stick. I thought it was a snake. I was like, oh god, <laughs> was I bit? I don't know. I think it was a stick. It literally is like get to your. And that's just in the middle of the night because there's like no lighting, can't yeah. see anything. So you're like literally you're like walking kind of a little bit towards in the woods to get to the bathroom. So. Yeah, it was a hard to adjust for me. I I, I guess I am bougie. I, I don't know, but Let it was me a tell little you, rough. My take me. on camping is a cabin mm -hmm. <laughs> with all the essentials. Yes, with and everything. camping. And then when I want to go outside and walk a little and ways, then, take a walk, that's camping to me. Mm -hmm. Cause I am not gonna get nobody's tent. <laughs> I'm not doing all that stuff. No, 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 no. no. Thank you. It's you rough. Keep that. Yeah. We could we come from the cabin and take a fishing pole and go out there and fish. <laughs> we ain't not nice camping. And go back in the cabin with a glass of wine. Right. And put on a nice little Netflix movie. And that's my <laughs> idea of camping. A TV, computer, all that I good mean, stuff. I mean, we had a TV. We, we, we did have a TV and a, in, in the main thing. But so, so it was, I guess, glamping. It just wasn't as the glam, glam. part as I... <laughs> Like, I, need I was like, I okay, think. yeah, it was, you could not wear makeup, it was too hot. Um, I think the, the fun part though, we did end up going to um, a place called Kraus Springs, which actually was really, really nice. It's cool, it's like has this nice waterfall and it's very green. Okay, and um, yeah, it, it was very, very pretty. Um, and what I really loved about it, it was just, it first of all, it was very slippery, people were just busting their butts. So, if you want to go somewhere to make funny viral videos of people falling. 
that's the place to go. Really? Because y'all swollen? Yes. It's very yeah. it's um so it's Texas, so obviously the the moisture and all of that just creates this very like slimy algae on these rocks and people were just like literally trying to walk down the, the um rocks and I just slid in like a polar bear. It was so slippery. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it, it's very um it, it was just very pretty though. It was very beautiful. Waterfalls, like the people who are on these like swings, like, you know, swinging into the water and stuff like that. Oh, okay. So that, that was, that was very nice. I thought that it was good. Like but yeah, on your way in, you're, you're with like livestock, like literally cows grazing and horses. And was there deer there? I can't even I remember. I deer. I saw horses and cows. Yeah. And just cattle. chilling. Mm -hmm. Hanging out. Like, they're like, hey, watch out. Don't kill our animals. Don't Could kill our livestock. Them? That would be fun. Mm -hmm. to ride. I'm just like, mm, I gotta have all the other stuff that right. I got at home. <laughs> yeah, and it definitely, you know, it, like it wasn't bad. Like we, mm. we had all that stuff. It was just hot. There okay. were bugs, and, but thoroughly, I enjoyed it, and I did like um, the ranch that we were staying on. It was really nice. The air trailers were nice. Mm -hmm. You know, having they were, the air they were conditioning out. was awesome. The but there was also um, like a portion of it where um, it's called like the sleeping patio. Mm -hmm. and um, oh, some people stayed on that and what they had was like some uh, some hanging where the queen size or like full size beds it was, like, yeah four. just like hanging, hanging from the ceiling yeah they're hanging from like it chains. was really outside pretty. no it's, uh, well oh. it was in like a, a i don't know what to call it like a, i guess you would call it like a barn but the wa but the walls they call it a porch but it's it's, it's all surrounded by screen it's oh, all surrounded okay. by screen. so you can hear everything going on outside you can hear the bugs you can hear like you know at night all it is it's just but you're enclosed you're enclosed in a screen yeah and it i, I guess it's air controlled because it has fans in there but mm. yeah it was really really pretty they decked it what I will say about the place they did great with the decorations I thought they were giving it a certain feel they had like this little rustic country right. side feel and then in the main um, sitting area they had like kind of like a what do they call those um tax is it taxidermy like with the the animal heads is that am I saying that oh, right I don't know. That's anyway awesome. the animal heads where they like have the deer heads hanging from the wall mm -hmm. and you know, cow skin rug and that mm -hmm. sort of cow thing. Cow skin chair. Yeah, it was just yeah. really, it, it, they did a great job of just decking it out and making it look really nice. So that that I thought was, was really nice. I just, I think I'm just me and mother nature. Well, not <laughs> mother nature, me and nature. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if we're the people I for each other I would go to the bathroom sometimes. sometimes and I'd be like, nope, there's a bug flying around in here. Can't do it. I'm gone. I, didn't even, I would just I close my eyes. Were and they go in, big like, enough? To, okay. I mean, they were bothersome, but were, I was told because they we would you know um, some of our friends would say, oh that one's not gonna hurt you, like don't worry about it. But I bugs? can't get over that fact. Well, like, it's just, no. They were saying they were talking about these black bugs called dirt divers. We've never heard of this. Okay? Yeah, yeah, I've never heard. Born and raised in California. There's bugs. There's different bugs everywhere you go. Like right. we have. Right. Let's not judge. Like I'm from San Diego. We see water bugs with mm -hmm. AKA big. You know what you know. You know, right, exactly. Right. So she was like, "Hey, don't worry. These black bugs, they're gonna probably fly into you, but don't worry, they won't hurt you." So one did like really like me. It was <laughs> I must have just been it for him, and he just kept but like flying, and I eventually I like flicked him, and he disappeared. I don't know, but um, yeah. So there were certain bugs, and then we got introduced. I've never seen a locust before. Yeah, the, you seen one? I've never seen one till. I hear them, but you don't see them. Oh, you see them. Ooh, what else <laughs> so they're in the them? fields, and they're like clicking around. And those are weird because they like mm. they're almost like grasshoppers, like click around and they're everywhere. So that was pretty interesting. When we left, we saw a little baby deer. Mm. <laughs> so. And then the good part about it, we got to get to civilization for a little while. We got some Whataburger, all my <laughs> Texas people. Not just Texas, because they're, they're like yeah, in Arizona, Arizona too. too. But I love Whataburger. Shout out to Whataburger. Can y'all come to California, please? Because in and out is tripping. <laughs> please come to Cali. I absolutely I like Whataburger. Whataburger is one of the freaking best. It's like the burger mm. your mom makes when she just wants to do something special for your birthday. It's like, here's this hamburger. <laughs> I made it with love, baby. That's Whataburger. They make it with love. Yeah, the little, love yes, them. they're awesome. So, yeah. Mm. I don't remember the last time I had it. Maybe I'm tripping out and I was getting it confused in and out because I felt like the burger was much bigger than I anticipated. Yeah, the water be. burger. Yeah, the water burger is big. No. I, that's all I remember. It's like a mm. big giant patty. It's seasoned to perfection. Yeah. Those people yeah. could Ooh, not. I've goodness. had it in about three yeah. different states. They cannot mess it up. And I haven't like, had a bad water burger yet. Yeah. 
I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting for y'all to mess up. People go, <laughs> don't mess up. People go crazy over Chick Fil A. I'm like, what a Chick Fil A. Chick Fil who? What a burger. What? <laughs> what a burger. Mm -mm. What a burger. Mm -hmm. You know, I was just telling um, your mom that In and Out has a protein burger. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh protein my goodness! Style, yep. Protein I love style. me some In and Out protein burger. Mm -hmm. That's y'all haven't had it. Get it and get everything on it that you would have burned. Everything. Mm -hmm. If you're a veggie, mm -hmm. get lots of veggies. Get raw onions. Get that sauce, that crispy lettuce. Put the juicy meat and the yeah. cheese and the. Mm. Yes, it's in and not out. on the menu. And if you get. If you get your burger protein style, make sure you get the double double. Make sure yeah, you get the double, double double. It has to be. Wait, what's fresh the double onions. double? Just the double. It's patties. a double patty. Oh, because so, one, if you have it protein style, then yeah, it's lettuce. yeah. Because there's a lot double. of lettuce, and I, which I love because it's like crispy mm -hmm. and fresh. I oh, usually do that. We should do a video on that. <laughs> Yum. We should. I love like a good protein burger because if you're if you're doing keto, you just right. want to like you know have that something. Is that um, used to you be just wouldn't even think. How good it is because without the bread. Yeah. Right. No and bread. it's still extremely satisfying. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Don't mm -hmm. think you're missing anything with that bread. So mm -hmm. you forget about the bread. You really when you do. Because mm -hmm. it's so good. There's it's so many good. keto options. Like I really love the fact that a lot of restaurants are catering to that. Mm -hmm. and keto. Just vegan, know vegetarian. it's not on the menu. No. So you mm -hmm. have to ask. You just yeah. have to just whatever burger whatever. you want. However you want it, just say protein, protein style to remove the bread right. and they'll wrap it in lettuce. Girls, yeah. I am full. Oh, oh, Me oh, too. Oh. Ooh, it was delicious. It was, oh, it was, it was so good. I wanted to eat so much more, but this gotta stay in my stomach. <laughs> I think I, t I think I, 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 I well, tackled mine pretty well, but. So, oh, I ate I've been in the woods stuff. for three days, people. <laughs> I'm in the freaking I'm gonna steak. Have leftovers, <laughs> Me too. Yeah. Yeah, definitely have some lunch tomorrow. I'm going to be picking on sure. it, but goodness gracious, this steak was awesome. It was a so good. Especially with the, the A1 mixed with the, Ooh, the, blue, the blue cheese. cheese. The blue cheese, cheese. yes. It's really good. Oh, my goodness. So good. Yum, yum. That's new for me, and I'm definitely going to do it next time. Yes. <laughs> Thank you guys for joining us today. Yeah. As always, you know what to do. Please like, subscribe, and ring the freaking bell, man. And leave a comment. We <laughs> like leave comments. A comment. We love comments. Let us know what you like, your favorite steak, how you like your steak done, rare, well done, whatever. Medium else. well. Medium, medium well, rare. all that. Medium. J fr fresh off the butcher's block, <laughs> whatever makes you happy. Just like that. Yes, exactly. Just like that. <laughs> Bye, everybody. We'll Bye. see you next time. See ya.